Welcome back to the channel and welcome outside. We've left the hitting bays of modern golf and we've come outside to Piper's Heath for a great little short game battle between myself and a couple of the modern golf pros. Episode two of this series, it was all about competitive practice. Emma and I went head to head on TrackMan indoors. And like I said at the beginning, we're outside now because we're focusing on our short game. Doing a little bit of head to head to head with Stu and with Kieran for Modern Golf. But why do I think this is probably one of the best things for your short game? Well, you've got one shot. Hit it close amongst your friends, you get a point. You hit it furthest, you lose half a point. So there's no room for error. You have to be focused. You have to hit good shots. In our game, first one to three is gonna win. It's just gonna push you, it's gonna force you to focus, get creative, and hit good shots around the green. Recognize Stu from episode three. He is back. And who do we have here? Kieran. Kieran Harris. Kieran Harris, you're the head instructor? Director of instruction at Modern Golf in Toronto. Awesome. Yeah. So we'll give you the honor of tossing the tee to determine the order. Here we go, boys. You. So I'm one. The cameraman. I'm one. Stu's two, Kieran's three. So I pick the first hole. Okay, we're going all the way down. There's no holes in the green. So it's closest to that stake way down there. That'll play. There's, there's room there. There's room there. Ultimately, you don't want to be furthest away. So yeah, you want to hit a great shot, but you want to hit if someone hits an even better shot, it's fine. Being furthest away is no good because you're losing half a point. And Stu, you are the furthest. A little heavy. A little heavy. But he's, is he going to sneak it by him? No! <laughs> Kieran, negative half. I got one. Now, Stu, you're picking the next hole. Caught yeah. a little sod there. Listen, I, there was a little TV timeout between shots there. I just got to get fresh. I'll be back in this. Okay, okay. Yeah. Drop. Okay. Drop. We'll go short point. flag here again. Short sided. Nice. Ooh, that's tasty. Oh, that's a bad break. That's a really, I feel so bad for you, man. That sucks. Oh, that's a nice Great line. drop. Sometimes you just got to know how to drop. Doesn't want the. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's gone. Okay, so Kieran and I are both at half a point. My excuse there is uh, I haven't hit out of ryegrass in quite some time. These guys can spin it. I'm used to Bermuda, so that was that was a bad. Get a lot of short practicing in the snow, eh? That's our. Uh... Oh yeah, eh? Oh yeah, eh? <laughs> okay, what are we picking here? We'll go to the uh, the farthest one straight away. Farthest call. Okay, like okay the cone. See, the cone's problematic because if you hit the cone, it actually puts your ball further away. Which cone are you going to, dude? <laughs> Not that one. Oh, I'm up next. Oh. So, which cone are we? <laughs> the middle cone? No, I missed the break. And the wind and the ridge took it right there. But the middle one, the far one. Yeah. Whoa. Wow. The wind really affected those oh, shots. Yeah. Wow, a lot of chatter on my ball, right? I'm yeah, yeah. So closer than you. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Stu. Oh, no. <laughs> so, Stu, you're at negative a half, half, and I'm at one and a half, and now I pick. From here, we're gonna go to that pin up there. You gotta throw it. Yeah, it's got to get to the fescue. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Very tidy. Okay. Ah, oh, it's better than advertised. It looks all right. Ooh, big tough behind it, though. It's tough. You got a little false edge here, and if you go too far, it's way down that slope. Uh-oh. 
great lie. Great lie. All you gotta do is hit the green. Uh oh my uh. <laughs> All shaft, but I don't know who's further away. Well, if it's still on the green, I think arbitrarily you should just get the half a point or I'll take the loss. So I'm negative one, I'll take that. Can't miss the green from there. My pick, eh? Maybe put redeem something. redeem myself yeah. here, yeah. It's a short video. <laughs> let's go pretty basic here. Let's go just a traditional little, we'll let this one place. Yeah. Straight away, let's see who can actually get a basic chip shot. Nice. Oh, that's gonna be hard to beat. Great shot. Thank you. Open the door. On top there to the stake. Ooh. Couple of you play. That's nippy. Great. Beauty Shot. there. Ooh, lovely. Not bad, all things being equal. Uphill, uphill five, but Not good. There's a lot of room. A little heavy. A little heavy. So, Stu loses half. Kieran gets one. So he's at one and a half. I'm at one. Stu is at negative a half. So you have choices all the way or use the hill. Okay. Ooh, that thing had some bite. Good shot. The stew is currently closest. A little heavy. It's gonna work. Oh no, it's not. He loses a half. So Stu is at a half, and we're both at one. And now it's Stu's pick. This game is tough. Because you just can't afford to hit a bat. You, you can't come in third. No. You gotta you gotta stay near the top. Even maybe for practice, three different wedges. Yeah. Right? See which wedge you find that you're most successful with, and maybe you surprise yourself with learning which club you actually choose. Because it's with. you gotta hit good shots to get the three points. I Holy only say God. that because clearly this isn't my short game wedge the way that I've been <laughs> playing so far. So yeah. let's go back. We're up the hill here. Oh, this is oh wow. A, yeah. uh, downwind, uphill, all the things you don't want. Oh gosh. <laughs> Stu's doing this for the camera. Wow. You're up. My, my worst Big shoes to fill. My worst fear is when Stu gets it going. Big size nine Oswegos to fill. What are those? Yeah. Okay, it's up. My pick. I'm at two, and it's my pick. Let's go. Let's go. I was wrong. It, it wasn't my pick. I got excited there. It's Kieran's pick. So he's giving us a little side hill, ball below the feet, to the short flag. We took the cone off because we don't want any help. He's got a false edge. Oh, that's oh, that's still really good though. Sneaks out enough. I would've been to win it. This is a big shot. If I'm closer, it's a huge shot for Stu. It's Karen. So this will get you to two if you hold on. Good shot. Good shot. So I'm furthest. So I lose a half. So I'm at one and a half. You're at one, and now you're at half. And now I'm picking. Golly. Okay, a little downhill lie, short-sided here. To the close one? Yeah. Okay. Oh, no! Oh, just barely chunks it a little work better than mine. Oh, boy. This could be monumental. 
He did it. So Kieran's at two. I'm at one. Stu's at half. Stu's pick. Go straight ahead. Just okay. Downhill lie. Downhill lie. To Coney. Ooh, wee bit scuffy. So Kieran, if you cozy this up there, you basically win the game. If you if you lean this against the po the post, the cone, the cone of destiny, the cones of Dunshire, the cones of Dunshire. Uh oh. Ooh, we got some chase. Okay. Now we're both at two. <laughs> And Stu's at zero. I got a lot of work to do. <laughs> so it's Kieran's pick. And we're tied at two. Stu, you're just playing the role of, uh, if you don't hit it closest, one of us wins the game. It is gonna be Kieran or AJ. Kieran has the advantage of picking the shot. You can place this one. Can do a little cute one. What's he doing here? Ooh. Oh, he's making a new one, I like it. Oh, you're making a new flag. Is that okay? Is that okay? I think it's okay. He's gets a Jeez, ball. what kind of game is this? Just pick. <laughs> oh, I like. Let's put a flag right here. Oh, man. Well, All right. That's 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 All right, Stu. You got to hit it inside that, or I'm going to win. Oh, don't go down you need a measurement? It's a good over. game. It is indeed. I hope you enjoyed that video. Thanks to Sue and Kieran for uh, hanging out and taking part. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And, and go try this at home. Let me know if it takes you nearly as long as it took us. Peace.